I, I got involved with Jeremy as a lunch buddy, first of all, back at Polk uh, about four years ago. And then uh, we decided to get what's called a community match, community-based match. And uh, we've been hanging out doing stuff every week or two for about three years now. At first, I wasn't a good student. And then Steve helped me realize that I can get somewhere in life if I am. So I keep, I try as hard as I can now in school. At first, I used to just blow it off and then he helped me. I found a lot of joy in just showing him how you can learn something all the time just by asking questions. And I can tell you one of the good things I've felt in the last year or a little more is how Jeremy is starting to ask deeper and better and more questions uh, just about everything. We will end up at a place like the library. We'll ask a question as we're just driving to grab a burger or something. I'll say, that's a great question. Let's go look it up. The school district utilizes volunteers for a variety of reasons, but one of our most key areas is reading and literacy support. We have over 7,000 registered volunteers in the Cedar Rapids School District, and many of those work with, work with students on their reading skills. I know that reading helped me get through high school and college. Um, it's just the foundation for any other classes you might take when you're older, so I feel it's important to work with kids on reading. opportunity to have volunteers in the classroom helps our teachers be able to focus on their jobs so we certainly rely on volunteers to provide that extra set of hands and that extra help but having another adult read with them helps to strengthen students interest in reading when they see adults care about them and care about their reading skills and in turn that does improve their achievement in reading. We have volunteers read with students one-on-one uh, -on -one or in small groups and it is really important because some students don't have anyone that reads to them at home so it's nice to have an adult that cares read to them here. Most classes rely on reading, you know, even math story problems. Um, starting in you know, third grade, if you don't know how to read, you'll be behind in most subjects. And so I just feel it's important to teach kids to value reading. A lot of people can share a little time and then uh, it's no cliche, you'll get more than you ever get. It's a wonderful thing to point out to Jeremy, to point out to anybody that once you discover that learning is fun, everything opens up and everything is possible.